Justin Brownlee was right in the middle of two controversial plays marred by non-calls that went the Singapore Slingers way in a 90-80 win over a lab Pilipinas on Wednesday at the Phil Oil Flying V Center. Brownlee appeared to have forced Xavier Alexander into a traveling violation when he contested the latter's shot attempt, forcing the Slingers' import to put the ball back on the floor after taking off for a jumper. Alexander then attacked Brownlee and made a tough high-looping jumper which the referees ruled should count, even though TV replays showed the shot clock had already expired before he could let go of the ball. Still, Brownlee reduced to pin the blame on officiating after the defeat that ended a lab's three-game win streak. You can't control that. The refs are not perfect, I'm not a perfect basketball player, so they make mistakes, said Brownlee, who finished with 16 points as he tasted his first defeat as an Alab import. They try to do their best, and I'll try to do my best, because that's what I can control, he added. Instead of sulking over the non-calls, Brownlee tipped his hat to Singapore for going to the Philippines with much more intensity and outplaying a lab right in its home court. They were just hungrier than us. Yo, you know, losing a few nights ago, it showed. It's just that they came out more intense. They wanted it more tonight. That was the big difference, Brownlee continued. A three game win streak may have also lulled the lab into complacency, Brownlee said. Hopefully, we can get our rhythm back. A lab fans need not to worry, though as the 6'5 do-it-all wingman believes they'll only get better as a team after the defeat. On a personal level, he believes that he's just beginning to get a grasp of Alapag's system. I think I'm adjusting well. The team is helping me in communicating, and we have a good time, Brownlee said.